Axel. Mid lane, a complete group up now as MSS is going to get caught out by the Fire Blaster Matthew. Toss him right up and take him down. Alone. The stand in the Thunder Awaken. Able to secure. Cloud's gone. You are also getting caught as you saw. And well, actually, there's live action going on as well. Mid lane, Quint gone for a rolling Thunder. Get Matthew down. Replay still going as well. Jonathan, we've got too much action in this game, number one, as alone. In trouble, disposes there, get him out of position. He's still alive though. He'll ferry fire up and here comes the turnaround. Sacred's gonna show off to help out his team is Quinn. It's gonna drop and the tips are out. Oh, alone, he makes his way out just fine as Sparta. He's gonna try and run. Nightmare is there, but he is not making it. Eventually, awaken. Grouped up in the mid lane now, but Sonics are making their way over. Quinn will show up, but Matthew will go for a quick avalanche into a cross combination on the Fana. That'll be one down. Quinn will go for a rolling thunder to try and get a bit of a trade going here onto Matthew. He'll catch the tiny at the very least. That might be it though. Still a decent trade for Sonics. They go for a bit more now onto Sacred. He's going to be way too tanky to even consider. Still alone. He's a great target. On that two, with the heavenly jump away is going to be there at Sacred. Now right back in. On to three heroes as Leslau. Going to drop. MSS is going to try and fight back, but it's against a Timber Saw. It's not going to work in his favor. He'll keep trying to run. Keep trying to play around the Timber. Even you are joining in the fray, trying to help out as they will beat grip up the Ogre. They just need anything around, going for a smoke of their own now. He does have the Fiend Trip if he does want to commit onto Matthew, and he may just. Nightmare is there, Sacred will be right behind him though. Persuading them for making the jump in, but they'll go anyway. Rolling Thunder is there for Quinn to hold down the tiny bit. A big avalanche out, Matthew! Setting up a decent team fight now. They've lost MSS and Barter, and now Quinn, he's not out of the woods yet either. Wrapped up, chased down and taken out. Very confident play from Sonics, but one gets caught here. Instead, however, towards the north, you are getting spotted out, and that's a much bigger target. Oh, Look boy. how fast he just gets bursted down. No chance of survival. Radiance bottom. Have their smoke broken by Panda. Win. And able to land the swashbuckle with Sparta. He's going to move right up to the high ground, but he's going to get bursted down immediately. Rebound is there. On to the tiny at least, and Matthew might drop it. Here comes the cast. Right onto the razor. Leslau's already gone. MSS, he'll try to go for a run, but the cars is right all over it. You are, he'll pop his BKB into the Eclipse of Sacred. He's fine to chain away, so the Dispose Whatever. is there, and MSS now set up for a nice kill, but for cars, now knowing you are, has no BKB, will jump right back in onto the Lunar. Take him out. What the hell does Sacred care about dying, John? You've got the pause one looking. He'll break the smoke every time. Win. The move in, they have the vision. Oh, they do. They see the monkey king, the cars. He's been caught out and taken down. Oh, they saw him from the high ground. Onto the yoga they go, they'll catch another. Maybe they at least find the baby part is fine. That puts the one in danger now. Not chasing down as quick, making the jump right in, but they don't want to go into sacred. Timber, still a big problem for them. Quinn, has he gone a bit too far here? No. It does seem like he may have, and he will drop. There's Lau trying to deal with Sacred, but this Timber Sword just so darn tanky. Taking literally no damage. MSS still running. I may not make it out of Sacred. This man just doesn't quit. He continues chasing down Les Lau. He won't get him eventually. Say, oh, never mind, Sacred. You're blinking in aggressive. Sonic's not in a position to try and defend. Matthew, right in. On to Quinn. Look at that. So much damage. The Ethereal Blade out now as well. Matthew, he, he just bursts him down. MSS, he's not going to make it out either. Under Awaken, man. They are just so aggressive. <laughs> Literally everything. Uh... Us. Oh, that's right in. He's found Lens Lau. Counter Strike is there. The Razor's gone. Onyx, going to get the hell out of there, but Matthew's going to jump right back in. Oh, might just go down. In fact, never mind. Matthew, the one to drop first. Okay, that's, that's another awkward interaction. There was a toss back on Pakaz instead of the target Matthew wanted. As we saw last time for Beast Coast as well, with Whisper getting tossed back while he was zipping. Sometimes going in between a tiny and his target is not what you want to do. Gonna keep 
trying for that mid tier 3 tower, but Quinn is there with the Rolling Thunder. In fact, never mind that, because he'll go right after the Timber Swap, but the Boundless Strike is going to be out into the Wukong's command. It's a big one for Sonics. They do back off. In fact, for Cars, he's the one dropping low, but still holds on to the Aegis. Galone, take down Farda. Us, still going back Quinn. Oh boy, Quinn. He's getting completely destroyed here by Alone. And that mid Rax, it is not long for this world, John. It's gone. Alright, it, it, it's going. And Sonics, they, they don't have presence. They don't have their clips, main source of damage. In what a giga chat I am. <laughs> They're like, I don't need it. I just bought it to show how much more farmed I am. If that's all it is. Well, late. Rolling Thunder's out early. Matthew, meanwhile, already fighting Fado on the Bane. Win will at least control a couple of heroes up, but there's your BKB on now from the cars into the Wukong's command. They've got to be careful here, Leslau. His BKB is about to wear off. He'll try to go for the link out onto the Monkey King, but it's going to wear off very, very quickly as Leslau. Trying to bounce around the map with the Bounce Strike. It's there again. Win in a, in a pretty tough position. Does go down as you are. He's going to pop his own BKB. Go for the Eclipse and actually takes down the cars. Not a bad kill here. But you are, how do you get out of this? Alone, he's still a massive issue. You take him out, no problem as Quinn. He fought back, but he might be getting taken down once again as Matthew. Is there in time, Quinn? Watch buckle and blink away. It's killable. Another ugly way to put the, skip, the spells in the jump. In fact, hold that thought for a moment, because Sacred's going to make the jump in, and MSS is probably going to get deleted here, though never mind. Rebound is out for Quinn. For one drop even lower. Still finding a way out though, it's only Farda to go down. You are, and as well, Poe's gonna show up now and try to force the fight. He's gonna find an exit plan. You are, in a bit of trouble now. Being bashed off through the BKB as Matthew. The way to jump in, the Crips is being committed, but it's doing absolutely no damage through the BKBs. And now, with the Luna Court out, you are gone. As well, he's not making it out either. CG's called. Sonic, they've seen enough for this game one. And Thunder awaken. Can get topped up. He's very low on HP. Instead, Ops to stick around, tries to go for the Water Rune and gets punished. So, an after up start for Quinn, kind of balancing out. And we have seen the counterpoint to what we usually see with a bad rider. Quinn's now doing quite fine. And he certainly is. You see it for Quinn, just put a keep up now on the Void Spirit and just overtake the Bat Rider. Hot lane. There's Lau being chased down here with the Brewmaster. Maybe in a spot of bother. He will land the Ignite eventually in Leslau. He'll try to run, but Matthew... You're not going to have that juicy little bottle for a run uh -oh. at all. Oh, could be a counter tip coming, John. Quinn, into the Revenant, he's going to land, but now the Lasso's out. The Bat Rider, he'll drag Quinn right back, but alone, dropping way too low, trying to duke him out, but can't quite do so. Quinn's fine. They even saved the regen rune for him. And suddenly alone goes down immediately after... Yeah. They try to catch up for Kaz as well down Bond. He doesn't have and to swing into Trio though. Yeah, double damage picked up here by Quinn, so he's gonna try and go for the kill, but here comes Alone along with Matthew to try and turn this one around. Quinn, he will step away. MSS gonna be there to try and help with the lasso. Alone, he's gonna land it. Quinn might just go down and does. Himself <laughs> once again the Void Spirit. They are really giving it the way of Quinn. The cars will join the team fight to MSS. It'll be a tiny gone and Fada. Probably not gonna make it out either. No way out of this one. The cars are the double and see just taking all these agents away. In the meantime, on the east side of the map, Fada. And the tanker gank here from Thunder Awaken and does go down. Won't mind too much. He is just a pause five inch, but We'll drop bomb nonetheless. Yeah. Uh, I like the wards coming out from Thunder Awaken. Attack. They've got really good aggressive wards Dyer's once more. Top watching top the camps, top. watching that top jungle, even watching the Roche, because they are playing against a TA. Have to be keenly aware of that desolator timing. They're not going to be allowing Sonics to just find it. Still smoke out from Sonics, though. They've got the win. Here come the rotation, Sonics. They will run right into Panda, but Tata, he does get stunned up. Lesla, right behind the train, no is alone, is waiting for the right moment. In comes MSS now on the tiny, and it seems like they might just have to settle for the ogre kill. In fact, never mind that, because they've got Sacred there as well. On the other one, just completely trapped up, and will drop. The rotation from Sonics this time around will pan out. They find nothing out of this. 
want to chase them. They are. Menzlau, never mind. We'll hand the kill over to the way of Thunder Awaken. Smoke out, Thunder Awaken. You'll find Lenslau and MSS down, hanging around, trying to farm off that large camp, but they do get caught out. MSS trying to help, and here comes the Fiends Gate as well, with the backup from Sacred into the pit of Malice, and even the Boundless Strike catching out Farna, but don't leave him be. They've got Lenslau and MSS, and now they'd love to rush into the triangle with that Farna. I thought he was out. Not quite, John. He runs back into the triangle and does get caught by Picaz. Another double kill for the Monkey King. Now even mid lane, the chase is on now for Quinn. The lone's trying to get in range for the lasso, but can he make it? Nice step away from Quinn the other way. Under there though, Quinn is trying to find a way out. The battle is not going to land, but the fire blast is there. So the lasso never going to come out from alone. He just wasn't within range. Now the heroes have respawned up from Sonics. They want to try and make a play here at least on the Matthew. They'll find a Zeus for their trouble. Still overall a pretty big... Sonics. They'll see Panda. They see Matthew as well. A decent avalanche onto the Ogre. It's the toss back onto Yawaru. Panda will drop. They find something. Now, not the biggest issue to break the smoke as alone is going to rush forward. They'll see the tiny. Not quite the kill they would have liked, but they'll take what they can get. Not secure it. Sonic, though, they're jumping in for a team fight. Cars. He was caught for a moment, but there's your lasso now. Onto the Brewmaster. There's Lau. Unable to get the split off in time, and Sonics they give away even more deaths here to the side of the smoke with the ogre. Under still going after Roshan. Where do they go in, Sonics? Still thinking about it. Primal split is there. They do find Matthew to get started. Rukon's command is out. Roshan is all over the MSS. He'll make the jump in. Aegis, the cars. He's the one to pick it up with the monkey kick, but he's cycled up with the tornado. Sacred has gone down. Alone, trapped up, is going to drop as well. My sprites are with us. Sonics. Around the road shop if they go. MSS with the toss up on the yoga. He did get a balance up quite nicely here, but Quinn already fighting Panda. The cars now trying to make a run away, but he's dropping so darn low on the Monkey King. Leslau just chasing him down and takes him out. We three things. Oh boy. That's you. Over a run, the fighters on the chase. Dan is up, but we have the swap for number one as Panda. He just pulled back for this job, but he's going to be going right back to the graveyard as they even found Matthew. Be the Zeus gone. That'll be the die back onto the Ogre. Good news for Sonic's John. Roshan is up in 30. Yeah, it's going to be a nice, quick, easy rush for them to take. But yeah, you've got this basher up on Fakaz. He's trying to queue up the butterfly next for a little evasion. A little bit of armor from the agility can be useful. But it doesn't feel like he has the space to get that. Nice jump in. Cars do just fine, but BKB is down for another eight seconds. He hasn't got the time for cars. He's gonna battle a strike and try to run. Stick charge up. Maybe he has got time, but no. Oh, he gets taken out. Great initiation by Quinn. Or even find Pandalu. Eventually, Leslau will have his way with him. Really nice initiation, and Picaz, he was eight seconds off his BKB timer. Oh, they found another. They're on to the Uplord now with a great toss back by MSS. Sacred God. More <laughs> <laughs> in the tree line but finds nothing. So without the Monkey King buyback, Sonics, they can just keep going high ground here. Another 30 seconds without the MK and 45 without the Uplord. Plenty of time to get some damage done. Radiant's bottom barracks. This is the primal split. That's now the backside is Panda. Already Radiant's get caught out. Matthew, he will get cycloned up here by Leslau. 
waited out a little bit of the fourth half. Heavenly jump is there. You can't get the damage on the back oh. now. You want Max Lasso into the fountain. He's gone He's way too deep. If you find the TA, I don't mean the push does come to an end as they just don't have the damage without him. Oh, they found Quinn. The cars. Stammer Strike was there in time. Quinn, he's very low on mana right now. He has to do the old bash away and just walk, but alone, he's gonna be there. Maybe no lasso off, but it won't matter. It's a crit, even Fiend's getting in. Quinn, still trying to run, but he is eventually gonna get caught out. Kind of tower. interested in playing the defense game here. So, Lasso, you know what? You know what? He's going to double Lasso opportunity. He will throw it out immediately onto the TA. Oh my god. He's got buyback on this TA, but he might need to commit. He will immediately. He needs to get back into this team fight. Anna, turn off the sacred. He'll try for the Underlord as Quinn. We'll have the damage up with the take him out. The cars. Well, he's thinking about the Wukong's command. He won't throw it out yet. Waiting for that right moment of sacred. He's pulled back as well, but he's right back into the arms of your one. Oh, it could be a dieback immediately. He's not careful. Nice four stuff away though as they find Father instead. You are. He can't afford to die. He'll four stuff out of there. The car's now in danger. The bomb is being him in your one. He's been caught out. He's gone. Oh boy, that's a dieback with your one. All buybacks flying out here from Sonics. They've caught out Father once again on the Enchantress. Win. Gonna jump back in onto the cars. A nice sub up onto the Unlord Sacred. He's gonna die back as well. Hands up with the buybacks of the cars. He's still trying to force the fight, but he's gone now. See, I noticed he does make the jump in. They've got Quinn. It's a lasso, but you are there to help out. Now the double lasso is there onto the Void Spirit. They get something for their trouble. A very risky play from alone, but it certainly pays off. You might find the Ogre now, but it's not going to be a great trade whatsoever here for Sonic. But here come the Cavalry. Beach Grip was placed down. They're going to climb to this team fight. Say so the bit of balance, but have they gone to their death tier? Oh, maybe they did not realize that Sonic's had their whole team around. New kind of feed kills back the way. Oh, team Sonic's is MSS. Time for one more. Haste down, Matthew. I already keep up with him, but let's now. He'll try to catch up. Your four staff even just toss him away. They're not playing you want. He's gonna be very careful. They think they've got the cars, but in fact they've got you want. DKB has been popped in time at the very least, but the cars with the Wukong's command gonna hold him down. You want can't afford to die like this, but he is gonna drop. He's got buyback though. He can rejoin the team fight if necessary. Quinn can make his way in as well. Sonic's probably not the fight they want. Back out of there. Don't want to have to force the buyback out of this TA, but an immediate smoke now from Thunder Awaken. You know, they've got the advantage and they want that buyback committed. Quinn, he doesn't have a buyback if they can catch him. It's Awaken moving right in, has found MSS. They do have the Titan to make the jump in on, and they will do so. You are still holding on to that buyback, not committing quite yet, but MSS is going to drop. Where's Lau now? Trying to find back. In goes Quinn. MSS is finally gone. Now the buyback's being committed. You are and MSS committing both of them as they fight and make their way back into the team fight. But is anyone going to be left to go after? Sacred. No dropping. Is going to go down. That's one. Even found the Ogre. Two buybacks committed. You got the Ogre, you got the Underlord. Not the greatest of fights here for, for Sonics, but it's still something. Since it's under a weight of mine, he doesn't have a refresher or bump, so plenty of charges to go. Slowly taking the tier 3 tower as it is a very nice pass back on the same but he goes to jump in for cars. What a massive power strike out from the monkey oh into the Wukong's command. Oh, they've already found the TA. Thanks for the first line. Can they get the second? The missile play down. Lasso to hold it down. They should have the damage. They've at least got the control with you are. He'll fight back. Onto the monkey king they go. The car's in trouble now on the MK. He might just drop. He can't find a boundless. He is gone. And uh, I'm trying to run. Surely goes down here as the buyback is there for Pekan with the pass back MSS. Forced the BKB out from the Monkey King. Wukong's command out once again. Onto Yuan he goes, but Yuan will make a run out. He might just re achieve right back into Sparta. He will drop it less well. He'll just keep the fight going. Quinn waiting for that, that Wukong's command to end. 
and eventually it will. They catch up the, uh, the lone Batrider now. MSS, make the jump in, but a Bounder Strike once again onto two heroes. That'll be MSS gone this time around. Alone, surely goes and does. Quinn, he'll get the job done. More buyback flying out of the cars. He can't afford to die right now, but he's a sitting duck. Surely taken out, and he will be. No cross one for the side of Thunder Awakeners. They'll lose Panda Mill as well. Onto the tier three tower, they go near Sonics. It's been a long, Dyer's rough game. Perhaps they force the tiebreaker they wanted. Sonic. Radiance Middle Tower. Take down the tier fours and it's onto the ancient. Radiance Ancient. That should be it, Jonathan. Surely a DD course coming. When make a jump in. Lasso is there. Maybe they drag him back into the fountain. Not quite. Win. We just keep going. Keep fighting them. Force the tie back. That'll be it. Quincy Crew. 